Hello everyone, my name is Anthony Sutton and I decided to do Vincent van Gogh. Vincent van Gogh was the eldest son of a Dutch reformed minister and a bookseller's daughter. He pursued various vocations including that of an art dealer and clergyman. Before deciding to become an artist at the age of 27, over the course of his decade-long career, 1880-90, to 90, he produced nearly 900 paintings and more than 1,100 works on paper. Van Gogh had learned about art by copying prints and studying 19th century drawings and manuals and lesson books, such as Charles Barg. He felt that it was necessary to master black and white before working with color, and that basically helped him start his his artwork. Who is Vincent Van Gogh? Some of you might ask. Well, Vincent Van Gogh was born March 30th, 1853 in Zondert, Netherlands. Van Gogh died in France at age 37 from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. He died July 29th, 1890. He got an education from Brussels Academy. His nickname is Christ of the Coal Mines. His occupation is a famous painter. Um, and this is what Vincent Van Gogh looked like. And this is a self-portrait of him. Uh, he created that in 1889 and it's an oil on canvas. Why I selected Vincent Van Gogh? I like Vincent Van Gogh because of his painting style and he's just very inspiring and inspirational. This includes oil, oils on canvases and watercolors. He created more than 43 self portraits and that's one of the 43 I mean that's one out of that's one out of the 43 self portraits that uh, Vincent van Gogh had created and he created that in 1889 and that's an oil on canvas and they were both paintings and drawings he was considered the greatest Dutch painter period of art van Gogh is a post impressionist artist he often used blue, green, and yellow. He painted figures, landscapes, and scenery. Van Gogh was a 19th century painter. In his early career, he painted with dark colors. Um, and it's another self-portrait. Uh, he used some blue and a little bit of green in yellow like I had said before and that's some of the stuff that he would often use and also he would paint with dark colors and I guess you can categorize that as a dark blue and so that's that's kind of a dark color that he would use uh, some of his influences his mother taught him how to paint at a very young age he became influenced by a lot of Japanese artworks and he began studying uh, some Eastern philosophy to enhance his knowledge of art and his life. Uh, he was heavily influenced by the Impressionists and Neo-Impressionists. His mother, his mother whose love of nature, drawing, and watercolors was transferred to her son which inspired him and some of the art pieces that we see today that were made by him. Um, so yeah, that's where he got his love for art from his mother. And that's a painting. Uh, it's made, that was made in um, 1888. And it's a uh, oil on canvas and it's called Bedroom in Aries. Some of his more, most important works is Starry Nights, Sunflowers, Van Gogh Self Portrait, The Yellow House, Irises, and over here to the right, this is one of the most important works that I had mentioned, The Sunflowers. And 
that was called yeah the sunflowers and it was created in 1889 and it's an oil on canvas and then starry night is one of the most important works that i had also mentioned right here um starry night was made in 1889 and that's also an oil on canvas and um, an interesting thing about this is he created this when he was in a hospital um, his success uh, he, at first when he first started off his career he had made no money from making art and he had only sold one painting during his lifetime his brother had supported him emotionally and financially he fed a lot and it taught him more about himself you know failure leads to success and also the brother situation um, that basically gave him um, support because uh, you know his he wasn't making any money and um, so his brother basically gave him some money to help kind of start his career out and then after um, Vincent Van Gogh had died uh, his brother his wife had promoted some of his paintings and then um, some of the paintings that she had promoted was uh, Cafe Terrence at Night, um, and that was created in September of 1888, and that's an oil painting, and also she promoted some of the, uh, other ones that, I, that a lot of us know, um, like The Starry Night, Sunflower, The Yellow House, The Irises, um, you name it. She, na she uh, basically promoted all of them. Um, and that's how he uh, became famous. Um, that's how a lot of us know him today. Because if it wasn't for his brother's wife, we probably would not have known about um, Vincent Van Gogh. You know, because she's the one who got the word out about his paintings. So that's how, I, I, I believe that's how a lot of us now know about him and his paintings. His role in the history of art. Um, Vincent Van Gogh had started the Expressionist movement. He was the first to paint using thick texture. And over here, I guess you could say, is an example for that. Um, that's a self-portrait of, of Vincent Van Gogh. And that's an, uh, the medium that was used was oil paint, and that was created in January of 1889 and um, that's uh, that yeah that's an example of thick texture that he that he had used for some of his works of art that he did um, you can see with the uh, jacket kind of uh, thick and also like I had said before he had used dark colors in one of the slides that I had mentioned um, yeah he uses dark colors right here there's dark there dark in the hat that he's wearing or cap um, he uh, created a lot of the paintings that we know today his paintings were known for beauty emotion and color like right here for example color and emotion and beauty and that is a really nice painting um, his works of art were high, highly influenced the 20th century art some interesting facts about Vincent Van Gogh is his brother had the same name as him and also Vincent Van Gogh was a, a pastor 
and he really, really enjoyed painting himself. Um, like you, as you can see before, in all um, almost all my slides, I had a lot of self portraits of Vincent Van Gogh. So yeah, he really enjoyed his paint. He really enjoyed painting himself, and he once fell in love with his cousin. He was also in an in an uh, sane asylum. He shot himself, like I had mentioned in the biography slide. Um, he cut off his ear, and he didn't start painting until he was older. His brother died six months after him, and he never found love in his life. And as a child, Vincent was silent and so serious all the time. And like I had mentioned in some of the most important art pieces that he had made, uh, this is one of them, the irises, um, and that was made by Vincent Van Gogh, and it was created in 1889, and it uses um, a medium of oil on canvases, 